this is Mirgloff, and this is Mirgloff Builds. And in this episode, we are continuing my uh, uh, my efforts to make a what a peculiar place for this mushroom to grow. Uh, my quest to make a mob grinder for XP, an XP mob grinder. And uh, I, pro I don't think I even mentioned that in the previous video that I was trying to make a XP grinder. Oh well. Uh, I was trying... I had a... Uh, go away, ghast. I had a spawner for blaze mobs over there, but it was just... in such a bad location... that I, that I couldn't really... Uh, try to even attempt to build an, a uh, cobblestone box around it. Interference with uh, zombie pigmen and ghasts. It's just. It's worth it to uh, look for another s blaze spawner. Or even just a spawner. Whoa. I wasn't even crouching. What is up with that? I was tweaking out on my uh, crouch button there. It didn't seem like it was working. Hmm. So how am I going to get to that uh, area that I saw? I'm going to build a little cobblestone archway so that I know that I've been this way. Steps down this way. Come on, there we go. Ah. There we go. Uh, yeah, there isn't going to be an easy way to do this. So ridiculous. There uh, we go. That's not what I want to do. And sorry for the silence there. I'm trying to concentrate. There's still, look at that, there's just this endless lava river that I cannot get past. I was better off going that way. What I'm trying to get to is over there. There's ghasts. Can I make a bridge? That's treacherous. I'm certainly not going to do it out of a... Uh, Another rack, I'm just building a temporary bridge right there. I need another one of these. To guide my way. Well, we're gonna try to make a uh, bridge here. Is there any ghasts? I don't really see any. This is, uh... Very risky. I was lucky to be able to collect my stuff after dying that first time, so I'm kind of really pressing it. But I don't think these ghasts can get at me. But I'd like to get through this as quick as possible. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to have to take some fall damage. Oh, uh, no, 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 no. comes the ghast. Well, let's get out of here. And build another 
obelisk over here. Breaking in over here. Build another obelisk. Actually, no, I don't want to do that. I will confuse myself. I always have the uh, torches facing me from the way I want to go. So I see the torches here. If I uh, place the torch over there behind me, I would have confused myself and I would have gone that way looking for a way out. Uh, here, a magma cube. Ugh. Okay. Sounds like he's inside this nether. above me. Oh, jeez. Well, I'm in. And I want to build a little doorway here, just so I know this is how I got in. you look at that? I'll have to come in back later to mine this. That's a very safe and easy spot to get some glowstone. And this is a dead end. Looking for a spawner. have no purpose for uh, slow sand, so I'm not going to bother with it. Try and make this room a little larger. Dang it. Alright. It's not going to give me much time to work on this in between uh, them spawning, but it'll be a lot safer. And what I'm going to do is dig out the. Uh, size of the room I want. Maybe a couple torches will slow them down, but I don't think they're affected by light at all. Not these ones. Oh, crap! Because my health is low, I wasn't paying attention. Using this iron pick, it's gonna be fast. I also uh, chose uh, blaze mob spawners for a uh, mob grinder, or for an XB mob grinder, is because they drop blaze rods, and blaze rods are something I'm gonna need for making alchemy stands. Blaze powder for uh, finding strongholds. Need to heal up there, but uh, I think uh, 
So uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to dig out that space like I said I would and then replace it with cobblestone unless I get lazy and just make a room large enough. But uh, I'm going to end this video here. If you enjoyed it, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And when, when I return, uh, hopefully I should have a area as I envisioned for uh, my blaze mob grinder for experience. And thank you for watching.